the machine vision space has exploded in popularity over the past few years. And when combined with smaller and more efficient machine learning software, the possibilities become nearly limitless. However, the vast majority of products out there today deal with just the light you can see. This is where the OpenMV Pure Thermal Board excels, as it contains not just a regular 5 megapixel camera sensor, but also a socket for plugging in FLIR Lepton modules to let your device see heat signatures in the infrared spectrum. Thermal sensing can be used for so many more applications that are possible with only a visible spectrum device. So now, let's go over some of the specifications. The Pure Thermal has some very powerful and capable components, including an ARM Cortex M7 STM32H7 chip, which is dual core, one of the cores is an ARM Cortex M7, clocked at 480 MHz, and the second core is an ARM Cortex M4, that's clocked at 240 MHz. In terms of storage, we have 32 megabytes of quad spy flash, and then 64 megabytes of SD RAM. Now for the imaging, there is an OV5640 camera that can capture images at up to 2592 by 1944 pixels. There's also a lepton socket that supports lepton modules between generations 2 to 3.5. There's a USB-C port that runs at full speed, which is 12 megabytes per second, for power, serial connectivity, and for USB mass storage. There's a micro SD card slot for saving images and machine vision assets, an HDMI port for viewing the video output at up to 1080p. There's a place to solder on an Atwink 1500 Wi-Fi module. And then finally, on the other side, is an 800 by 480 pixel LCD screen with touch capabilities. The main draw of the Pure Thermal is, as the name implies, thermal imaging. By using a lepton socket, this device can accept many different kinds of sensors. For example, maybe there's an application that requires a wide field of view and plenty of resolution, in which case the lepton 3 would be great. Or for something a little bit less demanding, the lepton 2.5 can be swapped in instead. Imagining the countless possibilities is exciting, as problems that were tough before can now be approached more easily. These could include monitoring temperatures across a group of people, ensuring that motors don't overheat, or optimizing airflow inside of an enclosed space. Even though the cameras are the primary feature, there are also other components on this board that enable it to reach the next level in terms of connectivity and modularity. Thanks to the micro SD card slot, images, videos, and logs can all be recorded over time for future processing or to train machine learning models. The addition of Wi-Fi is also great since alerts and other data can be streamed to IoT hubs via MQTT, or to a web server's API via HTTP. Add in the battery and this board becomes a computer vision powerhouse that is simultaneously efficient and small. Developing for a new platform can be daunting and sometimes take a while to learn. The Pure Thermal, however, is fully compatible with the OpenMV Cam H7 suite of functions and modules. Supporting overcode from pre-existing projects is simple. Getting started with writing code for the device is also easy as there's an IDE from OpenMV for writing MicroPython code. There are libraries for anything, from controlling various peripherals, to capturing images, and even running TensorFlow Lite models. If all of these features on a single yet cost-effective board seem compelling, be sure to visit the Group Gits page for the OpenMV Pure Thermal Board. And also make sure to view this project write-up on Hackster, and see the links inside the description on this video.